Isabel, good evening everyone. I'm here with the late night broadcast. <laughs> I hope I can make it through this. Right now in Kanisi, it's 1.08 a.m. on a Monday, January 22nd, 2024. Mm, there really isn't any news to speak of today, but... Oh. <laughs> Listen to this. I was having a hard time with my crossword puzzle, but I finally figured it out. Um... Oh dear. I guess that doesn't really qualify as news, does it? That's all for now. I hope you all enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Thank you, Isabel. And good morning, good evening, or I should say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and I hope you're having a wonderful night. For those of you that are watching, Um, uh, 5,684 bells. That's good. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Now, I better change this attire because apparently I kind of failed last time. Well, let's go back. Let's go back inside and change it up. Yeah, wherever you are, if you're watching this, you are part of one of many Night Dwellers, because we usually play Animal Crossing, um, New Horizons, we kind of chill here, late at night, and I don't know, I, I know, um, there are moments where it would be good to play in the day, but I usually oddly prefer the night, and if I could change, um, how, uh, I am able to, you know, set the shop's times differently, so, you know, have the shops open later, um, close even later during the night, that would be wonderful. And, um, <laughs> yeah, I think we're going to be doing that. Let's wear the safety vest, bottoms, um, headwear, headwear. Ooh, this cap could work. I like it. Okay. <laughs> <No. laughs> we're going to go with striped socks this time, and we're going to wear, um, tracking shoes. Hmm, he's very cute. Got a very cute look going on. I don't know. What do you guys think? Or do I go with the rubber toe sneakers? You know what? Let's go with these shoes. I think they work. Something about them. I like them. Okay. And it works with everything else. What about a bag? Ooh. And fish wings. Ooh, okay. Ah oh boy, but yeah, I kind of let me see what do I what do I have in my pockets? Not much. That's good. So yeah, I hope everybody that is watching or has found my channel, welcome, and I hope you're doing well. I kind of wanted to just um play some Animal Crossing for tonight, even though I'm gonna be playing and uploading again later. Um, because uh, specifically today. Um, I'm having, I was in bed, it's one in the morning, right? And I'm just, I got anxiety, <laughs> but it's okay, you know? I'm not here to like trauma dump, or at least I hope I'm not going to do that. If anything, I'm just uh, here to, um, I guess, keep you company, as in a way I keep myself company. I don't know if that makes sense. You know, it makes sense to me. <laughs> so, Rank S, congratulations, you've got a bed, a chair, a table, and a closet. Your home is homier than ever. 
enjoy the included gift and keep making that home happy. Thank you. Thank you, old Lyle. I think Lyle is the one that's in charge with the uh, Happy Home Academy. Here, Candice, a new resident moved to a plot you set up. As a small token of our appreciation, we put a thousand Nook files into your account. We hope you spend them on something that makes you happy. <laughs> no, just... Thank you. You know, a lot of success. I'm, I'm gaining a little bit of success on YouTube, to be honest with you. S seeing the numbers go up. Little by little, it makes me happy, and... With that success, yeah. It truly, truly does make me happy. And again, if you have not subscribed, and if you're just watching, and you're kind of filling out... Ooh, sewing machine, nice. <laughs> if you're just filling out, you know, the channel, and... You know, wanting to see what I'm all about, well... This is it, this is partially it. I like to play Animal Crossing, do Animal Crossing Let's Plays. I like to DJ, so I put out DJ mixes. I'm trying to make it weekly, you know, like a podcast kind of thing. So that way people have something to listen to on the weekend. Um. Oh so yeah, uh. Mm. Uh. Nug Miles. But, <laughs> yeah, so. I also. Um, work on memes. I uh, edit memes. I react to them and You know, I try to be as witty and funny, but yet genuine as I can too Okay, top a pop hairstyles imperial fence is nice Manhole cover stone tablet I'll tell that's kind of cool Wave breaker. Oh, I could probably use that Custom designs, patterns, I think we're gonna leave that out. Um, custom design pro editor, pro camera app. I don't really know what the pro camera app does, although it's 1,500. Um, top eight pop hairstyles. Let's go with... Let's go with wave breaker. Okay, and then we're gonna get something else. I guess we just get one of the, like, designs or something like that, just in case, you know, for the future. If I wanna work on, like, pro designs. Got some designs patterns, plus... That one's a little more expensive. So is the pop, top eight pop hairstyles. Let's just go with the patterns. Yes. Okay, perfect. Hey, okay, what do we got? Your app has been updated. Thank you for using the next shop. Okay. Peace. <laughs> I like it. I like how they're clapping. Okay. Um. Let's see. I, I'm sure I have more to say right now, but I want to talk to Isabel. Isabel, uh, I need you for a moment. I want to take a look at something. Oh, Candice, good evening. How can I help you today? I want to talk island evals. Are you curious about the current image of Kinesi? Okay. Right now, Kinesi has a three-star rating. He built a solid reputation and come up during many, uh, come up during many a watercolor chit chat. Okay, good. Let me read an excerpt from the feedback I that I gathered. Kinesi man, hearing about how chill it is, if I go 
I'd go if I had the chance. K S. Hmm. Well, there you have it. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Am I hallucinating or was that feedback signed by a KS? Yes, there it is, very clear. KS, as the penmanship is quite striking, if I do say so myself. Could it be? Can it be? It must be. That message is from the one and only KK Slider. What? <laughs> I can't believe it. We finally reached our goal of bringing our island to the attention of the KK Slider. Not only that, but he said he's looking for an excuse to visit. Oh, what are we waiting for? Yes, yes. Let's offer him the chance to hold a concert on our shores. Strike while the iron is hot, they say. Huh? Hmm. Ah, hello. Do I have the pleasure of speaking with uh, Mr. K.K. Slider? Yes, yes, I'm with the King, located on Kanisi. Yes, indeed we did. We greatly appreciate your valuable feedback. That's actually why I'm calling. If you're truly interested in visiting Mr. Slider, we would be happy to host you and your musical stylings. It's quite... I see. Oh my! You mean... Thank you so much! Yes, I'll be sure to mail you all the details straight away. The entire island will be looking forward to it. Thank you again, yes yes, talk to you soon. So, what did he say? The a concert, that's right. KK Slider is coming here. Amazing! Congratulations, sir! He could be here as soon as tomorrow, but he has to check his schedule, of course. Janice. Can you believe it? We finally turned our goal into a reality. To spread the news of the concert via our island broadcast system. I do hope you'll be in attendance, Candace. You simply must hear KK play. Yes, yes, you must. <laughs> Three stars is all it takes. I did. I think I forgot how many stars it took, but. Isabel, thank you for your help. And Nook, thank you as well. You both are amazing. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> amazing. So we're gonna actually be partaking finally in the KK concert. It'll be pretty magical as we all know how it how it goes. Um shop remodel notice. Open for business. Good. And we do have Sasha. I don't know if he's awake. Take a look. Hmm. We can go take a look. But yeah. Hey. So that's one big, um, uh, thing. One big goal reached. The amazing KK. So, the famous Canis has finally decided to grace me with an appearance. I'm just messing with you. I know how it is when you're the talk of the whole island. Us VIPs have to stick together. Don't be a stranger, Formage. Or Formage? I don't know. <laughs> okay. <gasps> no, 
he's probably asleep, or he could be out. Luscious house, right? I'm sleeping. Please don't wake me up, okay? Uh, well, okay, I won't. Alright, well... There isn't a whole lot to do. I mean, there is definitely... Um, bells to be earned. Fish to catch. Bugs to catch. Wave breaker, that's right. We could decorate our island with some wave breakers and I'm thinking, thinking about putting it on the top right of the island. But we'll take a look, we'll see. Um, I do also want to construct another bridge to help us um, go up. And I think it would be good to go up this area next to... to the museum but will we have room we'll see we'll see we'll see uh oh that's a spider okay that, that's a tarantula can't see it this way okay tarantula I don't think I've caught one, have I? If it's still there. Even if I haven't, I still want to catch it. Scary creatures. Apparently they're nice. Must be hiding somewhere. I don't know where it is. Must have ran off. Ah, there he is. I need to, uh, mm. come here. There we go. It's an easy, buddy. I couldn't see cut of the trees. Uh, that's a bummer, but it happened. At least I already caught it. If anything, I was basically trying to catch the tarantula for your bells, but that didn't work out. That's fine. It, it happens. Hmm. I want to see if I have room. Not room, but like, I want to see what... What I could do here. Oh, I could just place them here, yeah. Not so bad. We also have some fossils to, uh... Obtain. Dig. And, um... If, I don't know if it's after KK, I'm guessing so. Or if it's... Both after KK and um, reaching a, a certain goal, a set number of items, a set number of donations in the, um, you know, uh, museum to get blathers. No, not blathers. I'm sorry. It's already in there. Grand's <laughs> museum, of course. Um, the roost, rooster. Wolfgang. So, how are things with you? Let's talk. Alright. So what to do now? Day's getting away from me. Um... Uh, I don't know. He didn't give me a chance to respond. Okay. We'll take care. Hmm. 
if we got... Gotta order a... KK song too. Dang. We'll do that in a bit. For now, I want to know how much uh, I need for... 10 stone, 10 in clay. And I have a bunch of clay. Okay. So let's do that. Let's get a bunch of uh, stone and clay in. I don't know, we could make like two or three. Most likely three. Um, uh, what, what are they called again? Wave breakers? Uh, but yeah, um, I basically just decided to play tonight because I wanted to, you know, get, get away from anxiety and it's not so much getting away, but letting it be put to rest. It, it, the thing is, whenever you have anxiety, it's basically a, a mental slash emotional mechanism that's telling you, hey buddy, it seems like you need to do something important. Or you need to do something in order to, you know, reach where you want to be. Go where you want to, you know, go. <laughs> so, it's like an alert system, you know? You're getting too comfortable. You're relaxing too much. You're getting too complacent. It's time to do something to push yourself to move forward. And that's actually a very healthy way, in, in my opinion. Um, to look at um, anxiety it's to befriend it befriending your anxiety it sucks I know but if there's a will there is a way keeping your mind busy and focused and busy and focused in the right places and for me I want to be successful on YouTube and Twitch and be a content creator and, you know, do the things that I enjoy and showcase them to you. And in hopes, in, in, you know, all this work that I do, in the future, I hope to make a living from it. And when I can, it would allow me to do so many more things that are so awesome that I want to do. So, with that being said, this is one of the reasons why I'm here is because I feel like I need, I not only need to put something out, I want to put something out and I want to, you know, just maybe say a little something to not only help me, but help you. So whenever I'm struggling with something, I don't want to just vent it. I don't want to like trauma dump. I'll explain. I, I don't mind. Maybe it is trauma dumping. I'm sorry if it is. Is that three? I think that is three. But. Oh, a sewing machine. That's right. I got that already. Um, I want to basically look within myself and figure out, okay, how can I overcome this and how can I be better? How can I sort of crack the code to not being depressed or anxious you know try to figure out how to feel better and be better or be better to feel better i'm no therapist i'm no you know uh i'm no psychologist or anything like that i'm just i'm just a wolf boy making YouTube videos and playing Animal Crossing because I enjoy it and in all honesty um, the things I do on this channel and more is what I want to do for a living you know because I know what I want in life <laughs> it could be many things but ultimate goal definitely is just to be happy and I think that's what everyone's trying to go for, you know, it's just to be happy. Not just, but it's, it's the pursuit, right? It's the pursuit of happiness. Like in that one movie, right? Well, movie. 
Self titled. Uh, Pursuit of Happiness. It's so good. It's such a good movie. It really does give people hope. It gives me some hope. But anyways. I just, uh, want to share with you, like, if I'm struggling, um, I want to let you guys know how to make yourself struggle less, you know? Try to. Even if I'm just like some wolf boy on uh, the internet. Come on, fishing. And I think there's no greater game to uh, showcase that than, or no greater game to talk about these things than Animal Crossing, because Animal Crossing is very therapeutic for many people. And for maybe a smaller portion, it could be boring and it's not for them, and that's totally fine. You know, to each their own. Okay, so, um, we basically d did that. Playing machine. I don't want to... Mm, I'll keep the sewing machine in my pocket. No. No, I'll put it in the house. I'll just do that. I'll just put it somewhere in the house. And put away the rocks and clay. Maybe purchase a Nook Mile ticket and we're going to go fishing because... Honestly, I am in the mood to go fishing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> kind of smiling because I don't know. I, it, it, it's really weird because in a way, I feel better when I'm here with you guys. You know? Even if it may not be physically and it's, and it's through like, you know, a YouTube video. It, it's nice. It feels good. And, uh, it makes me feel better. It makes me feel like I'm doing something in my life. Yeah. I mean, I guess there could be some things I could talk about as to why I'm feeling a little anxious. Um. Oh, actually, I already used up all the clay and everything. That's... And the stone. That's good. Okay, so I guess I could just get myself a Nook ticket. A Nook Miles ticket. you already? I have, okay. Yeah, it's okay. Oh. Well, I guess that's why I'm going fishing and not catching bugs anymore. So, hmm. I am getting a little thirsty. I guess that's probably one of the few downsides of doing this is after talking for so much, I tend to get thirsty. <laughs> but water's good. Water, having water in your system is a good thing. Having water to drink is, well, healthy, obviously. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just saying stuff at this point or right now. And I think I'm getting a little good at it to just. Speak my mind, say things. No. Your Nick Miles ticket has been printed. Please bring it with you to the Air Canisi Airport. We must redeem it. Of course I will. Isabel is such a cutie. She is just dusting and dusting away. I love it. Oh. I almost forgot. I want to... Do some shopping. KK Cruisin'. I like this Misty Tea. I'm gonna buy it. Why not? Red Chino Pants. Mm, nah. I think we're good. Yeah, I think I'll probably invite a camper another time. 
probably kick somebody out in the island. <laughs> Maybe have a different um, uh, animal in my arsenal, a different villager. Maybe... Maybe Raymond? He's another favorite of mine. <gasps> Money tree! Awesome, okay. The, our flowers are doing okay. Water them real quick before... I forget. Uh, nor a mom, it's... Dang, what is it? What flowers are those? I forgot, but I like how it's centered now. Makes for a very interesting, like, X kind of, um, field. I look. That's pretty cool. Hey, 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 welcome to your one and only gateway to the skies. Can you see airport? How can I help you today? I want... I don't want to go to work. <laughs> Not yet, that's way in the future. But I do want to fly. Roger. By the way, it looks like you've got a Nook Miles ticket on you in case you feel like using that. So, just to get all the paperwork all official, where did you want to go? I want to use the Nook Miles ticket. Keeping flight logs? <laughs> so you want to use the your Nook Miles ticket? Roger. I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute, but let's check all your all packed, tools all ready. Time for takeoff. No bird will you oh Okay <laughs> Oh you have a good flight friend and when you need to travel just think what would dodos do? You know how um they have their own mail service? Oh man, I, I wish yeah. I wish there was a separate building for mail services to receive and send mail, you know? Even if it's just a tiny building, that would be really, really awesome. To have, a uh, Felis and, uh, got the other pelican, or... Pelican? The other pelican. I know there's two pelicans, one at night, one at day. But I forgot their names, or uh, one of their names. Um, and uh, the other pelican that takes your mail flies away. Oh man. Hey, I really do. Ooh, wait a minute. Look, look what we got here. <gasps> oh, we got bamboo. You know what? That's gonna come in handy in the future because oh no, unless I could have bamboo in a specific area. I took up a bamboo shoe. Yes. eat them and I do want to take these uh um uh 
the palm trees as well. I think things are about to get a little bit more interesting with our um, plant life. Okay, we're going to take a couple of these. Not too many. Just four. Four is good. So that way we can have the rest for fishing. So, um, what did I want to say? Uh, what was I thinking? Oh, yeah, so... The reason why I'm actually a little anxious <laughs> is basically because, um... Uh... It, it's gonna be a little stressful when I wake up. And the reason why it's gonna be a little stressful when I wake up is because... There's gonna be... A home inspector... To come and inspect, um the house that my family currently lives in and I think it's only as simple as just checking to make sure um we have like um what, what, what was it called again uh not the term I forgot what it's called oh smoke alarms fire detectors you know um and something else but <laughs> He's just trying to make sure our home is safe. And, uh... I don't know, I guess I'm a little bit anxious if he ever comes up to my bedroom. Not to say that my bedroom's like, all messy and all that, but... You know, I try to keep my bedroom clean and... Um... Livable. <laughs> Very livable. And, yeah, I kind of like to think about my bedroom as like... In a way, being in, an, being in a... Apple store. Weird, right? What I'm trying to say is, because I honestly am an Apple simp, I'm sorry, but I'm not that sorry. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, um, hold on. There we go. I like to have I like to um, adopt minimalism, so I don't like to have too many things, and if I do have a bunch of things, I want to at least make sure I display them, make sure they look nice. Um, right now, it's a long process of doing that because, you know, I need to save up money for like, gels or, you know, things of that nature, um, to just showcase like, like models or um I don't know shot glasses things of that nature you know keep my book separate um buy a binder with a bunch of card holders for my cards um basically all my Animal Crossing amiibo cards so it's really all about just being organized. That's all. Being organized, having less stuff. To me, that's, uh... That's important. You know, I don't like... I, I always try to declutter. And the reason why I like doing that is because it gives me less stress when there's less things that I have. Not too much, you know, just things that I really care about. And, um, it's, it's honestly so much easier to clean. But yeah, I'm a little nervous about, um, I guess that visitation, hoping that, you know, the home will pass inspection, that there will be no problems. But I'm also going to be a little stressed out because <laughs> my dog, Edna, my lovely, lovely little doggy, um, she could be a bit of a, a nervous wreck or a handful or a little overly protective. So, mind you, she doesn't bite, she just barks. Basically saying, hey, this is our home. Why are you here? Get out of our home. 
you don't belong here, you don't live here, I don't know you. Um, you know, I don't want you to hurt, you know, my family and... Basically, I'm sure if she could speak, that's what she would say. <laughs> but, you know, dogs bark. And when they bark, I'm sure that's what they're trying to communicate. So we haven't really done much fishing yet, like at all, and uh, yeah, let's, let's do that. Um, that said, I'm just going to be a little stressed out because uh, my grandparents, you know, they're a little old, or getting older, I should say, and it's only going to be me there. We'll see what happens, and we'll see how uh, how things pan out, you know. And I hope I can only hope for things to go smoothly, like I said. Caught a squid. Hmm. But yeah. Um. Other than that, I'm actually pretty happy that my channel is slowly growing. It's extremely slow, but I don't mind at all. And the reason for that is because um, I'd rather have some growth than you know, taking a step backwards or no growth at all. Any growth, as long as it's positive, right? Is what matters the most to me and uh you know there have been some comments here and there that um try to get under my skin but honestly when i look at them i can't help but just smile and giggle and <laughs> be am slightly amused but i really don't care for those comments if anything i care for the good ones you know i I know myself too well, and I know what I want. And for such comments to ever really bother me, you know. And if they do, I want to be healthy about it and um, being sure it doesn't become detrimental to me. Because we're all human, you know. We. When it comes to criticism or unsavory comments, we're all, we all feel something. Interesting. Got another fish over there. Maybe I could reach it. Let's see. But yeah. Either way, the numbers aren't li aren't lying. I uh, slowly growing. And I'm a little excited on what the end of this month is going to be like because at the end of every month or the start of every new month, I want to do a review, a month in review of last year, of last month, right? And hope, you know, just really see and hope what happens in the new month. You know, this channel is, and the whole process of videos coming out, it's very much steady as she goes. You know, I've, I have a schedule and I'm trying to commit to it as much as I can without really letting anybody know what the schedule is. I rather keep it to myself. And the reason for that is because I don't like to and I don't want to. Um, make promises that I could break and I can't keep. Um, because of course, you know, being held accountable is, is important, it's important. And I'm just trying to play things safe. So that way, there's, so that way I have some room for error. And with that room for error, I could learn from it and not feel like it's the end of the world, right? Nice. Oh, hello 
blowfish. I already have a blowfish. I'm surprised. Okay. Oh, we have a butcher fish. That's good. It seems like we're only going to be catching uh, sea fish, which is fine. Okay. I would have also liked to catch some river fish, but... I guess not. But we do have bamboo, and that's new. And we're going to get ourselves uh Oh, that's a sea bass. Nope, olive flounder. Got it. Olive flounder, I wonder how much they sell for. I might need to take a look, but it's okay. I don't need to. <laughs> it's gonna be sold anyways. I'm gonna sell everything. As long as it's uh, nothing new. Yeah, um... Looking at um, how the channel is progressing, I was at like when I first started 140 subscribers. I don't remember, but I went up and now I have like 180 or 181 or now I probably have 179. I don't know. You know, however much I have at the time of uh, recording and uploading. You know, this video. It's pretty awesome, and... You know, I, I do want to, like, talk about other things, you know? Um, just say my thoughts... On, you know... Certain matters, like... The whole people leaving YouTube, or... Um... A lot of uh, nice. A lot of um, you know, big name creators are uh, have left or taken a backseat at most. You know, giving giving my thoughts. I like to do that. I think that would be a pretty decent video. Not just because, but it's more like you know, I do want to share my thoughts. I do want to be part of the YouTube community. I do have this stone. I got a rock. <laughs> okay, cool, thanks. Seven stones. Mm. Yeah, we still got more. Keep going. So, when it came to content creation, I basically have started on Twitch. And Twitch was a little promising, but I think YouTube is a lot more promising. And I was even thinking about, man, there's so much potential. I'm struggling though. What's going on? And I'm seeing peers, seeing others that I have sort of crossed paths with for a brief moment, becoming more successful than I am. Now, the unhealthy thing to do is just be bitter and angry all the time throw shade at them. It's not good. A healthy thing to do is to be bitter and angry and not throw shade at them. <laughs> it's what you should do or what I'm doing is simply this. I'm pushing myself to create more, do more, damn it. You know, put more content out there. And make sure it's at a pace where I know that I could do it. And, um, come here, fish. I need you. Like a sell you. Squid. Catching a lot of squid. Well, I mean, the dev team at most did make, uh, uh what was that? Squid? Uh,. What was that game? It's Splatoon? Yeah, that's right, Splatoon. Dude, that game, I totally forgot about it. <laughs> it's crazy how, like, Splatoon is 
It's a great game, but Animal Crossing just like outbeat Splatoon by a large margin in sales and the enthusiasm is so much more for Animal Crossing than it is for Splatoon. Yet the developers care more in my opinion about Splatoon and it's like, damn. Kinda sad. So, anyways, as I was saying, <laughs> as I catch another squid, um, yeah, it, just channeling my energy into making more content, doing more, and making sure I try to do things the right way. There's not always there. There are some right and wrong ways, but. Is very blurry as to what those are and you know to find success in the online space you know being a creative individual you know come on come on fish come on ah you totally passed it no uh oh I came across Ludwig and his channel, a particular, really, a particular video. Got it. You got it. <gasps> oh, wow. Okay. Yes. We got an ore fish and I hope I catch more fish. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Well. You know, I, uh, I did not expect that. <laughs> no, I'm actually really happy. I did not expect to catch an ore fish. Awesome. Okay. I am, uh, that's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna not sell it yet. No, I'm not gonna sell it. No, I'm not gonna turn it into the museum yet. Maybe I could. And maybe use the, you know, me visiting the ore fish as a thumbnail. Yeah, I think that'd be a good idea. That's a better idea. Yeah. Or maybe me holding the ore fish. You know. Hold on. Um. Like holding the ore fish like this. Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> That would be a good thumb- that would be a good thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, I came across Ludwig's video. <laughs> God, I'm, I'm- I'm really, like, I'm smiling a lot. I, I don't really smile so- I, I don't really smile often, but... Um, it's rare that- it's rare that I do, but this is one of the few times that... Oh no, I do smile pretty often, now that I think about it. Only if I'm in a space where I'm happy to be in. Giant clam. But yeah. Uh, I'm really happy that I caught that oral fish. Or oral or fish? I don't know. Alright. So I came across Ludwig's video and it had to do about um uh trying to be successful on Twitch. And the only way to be successful on Twitch is not by streaming a lot. Being consistent in streaming is one thing, and that's a good thing, but being consistent on YouTube is another thing that in apparently, which is true, is better because once I have a video that is made and I put my blood, sweat, and tears into it, or really it doesn't take a whole lot of effort, um, especially once you get used to talking and being comfortable. Um, you know, just just simply talking to yourself as if you're talking to an audience. Um, it doesn't. It's not that hard anymore. It just takes practice. But what I'm trying to say is, once that video is out there, it's out there and. You could have it stay for as long as you like, and once it's there, you know, people will watch. And while you may 
say, well, I've tried before and I get no views. Yeah, that is true. But you have to, you have to take the punches. You have to take the constant failures. You know, with things like this, being a content creator, we, you have to be comfortable with failing so much, it just becomes normal. And you celebrate those wins. You celebrate those dubs. Because all you need is a couple of them. Even far between. You know, just to get the ball rolling. That's the important part. Just to get the ball rolling. And even if you have zero views and nobody's watching, take it upon yourself to not make videos for the views at first. But for more, but at the core of it is to self improve. Make videos because you want to make videos, whatever they may be. I enjoy DJing. I want to be a DJ at a club someday or. DJ at a convention, or, you know, DJ at, you know, f at parties. I, you know, would love to DJ at these amazing venues, or, you know, at these festivals. How fucking cool would that be, right? But, while well, I have that in the back of my head, whether it happens in my life or not, all I care about, I'm incent. All I care about front and center is to be a better DJ and to be consistent and to entertain, to put stuff out there, you know, every week because it's my own little passion projects among many that I want to be successful with. That's all. And... That's the view, the views, the audience, the people you find will come later. All right, Wilbur, I am ready to go, to go home. Yes, yes, Wilbur, I'm very positive. Yep. All right, let's go. Yeah, I mean, that could pretty much go with almost everything, really. Um, you, uh, thanks, guys. <laughs> okay. We gotta, um, sell our fish. Um, plant some, you know what? Mm. 2 a.m. I really do and do not like this song because it's so bittersweet. And if I listen to the 5 a.m. Uh, tune, I'm done. <laughs> I can't. I can't listen to that tune. It's. It's. It, it triggers me. Anyways, I'm gonna try not to pay too much attention over the past and focus on the future. So yeah, let's just sell these for now. Sell the fish. So, as I was saying, success... You really have to just, uh... Right, so... You really just have to believe in yourself. That's all. It sounds simple. It's not. But... Because you're taking up on that challenge, and if you don't give up, good god, are you a strong person. <laughs> Very strong. And, uh... Ooh, 15. And for those of you watching, you know, that wanna have your own successes in life, I bid you good luck. Truly. I, I believe in you. Wait, 
so uh I think we're gonna leave planting uh we're gonna leave planting the bamboo trees and the coconuts later and we're gonna turn this fish in later uh the ore fish ore fish the feathers we're gonna do that later yeah so yeah we'll do all this later so that way i have a chance to you know uh show it off in a thumbnail <laughs> wait but it's centered mm. That's gonna be hard then. Yeah, I can't do that. Well, you know what? Let's just go. Let's turn it in. I think it would be better to take a picture in the museum. Because, uh, I at least have a little bit more control. Uh, instead of just having my character front and center. I'm afraid I might just block. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Pathers. <laughs> I'm afraid it's gonna block my face. We're going to the Kinesi Museum. How may I be of service? I want to make a donation. You could do it as fossils then another time. Marvelous, uh, what would you like to donate? I'd like to donate this ore fish. Ooh, hi. This is an ore fish. Now, oh, might it interest you in a few fascinating facts about your ore fish? Yes, please tell me. Wonderful, I will love nothing more. Mm. Or a fish is a long eel-like fish that can supposedly reach up to 36 feet in length. They appear in various lengths as things like messengers of the gods. It seems to me a creature like that could explain the myth of massive ship-crushing sea serpents. It is, of course, well documented that people tend to exaggerate the size of one that got away. <laughs> and they have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Rest assured, all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. Thank you, Blathers. Um... Yeah, just assess the fossils. Why not? I think it's just one, isn't it? Yeah, it's just one. It's okay. Be plenty more in the year. Fossils are actually easier to uh, obtain, of course. Ooh -hoo. After some consideration, I can safely declare this fossil to be a trait. They're a tail. <laughs> Sertail, remarkable indeed. If only you could take it off your hands. Alas, we already have one, so I must return it to your care. <laughs> Thank you, Blathers. Well, I could sell it. Or, I could give it to Wolfgang. That's a gift. Oh man, I'm gonna listen to this music again. That's gonna make me all sad. Curses. Alright. Uh, where are you? Where is, um, Wolfgang? My lovely Wolfgang. You know, he could be anywhere, but if I can't find him after a certain amount of time, I think I am going to... I don't know... save... sell it? Mm. He has to be somewhere.
maybe he's in his no, he's not in his home. I'm not here. <laughs> what if he's at the beach area? What if he's at the beaches? Wolfgang, where are you at? Ah. Catch one? Oh, I, I can't anyways. Hmm. Where could you be? Ah. Oh. Okay, you know what? Real quick. Damn it. This is not quick. <laughs> nice. You're gonna bury it in the hole. Okay. Yeah, he's probably somewhere else. Some other part of the island, I can't tell, but... It's okay. me that. Okay? Because I know you got this. Um, yeah. So, as you know, you know, um, whether you're down and out or you're just having a bad day, I hope you had a good day. I hope I made your day a little bit better. I hope you came out of this with some hope, inspiration, or, you know, some good vibes, some positive vibes. You deserve it. Everybody does. Okay? Alright. I want you to take care. Drink water. Get plenty of rest. Yeah, just love yourself. And that's one of the many ways to do it. Alright. I will see you later. Take care. You. Hey, I sold it. Never mind. Better luck next time, buddy. 